Hello and welcome. Uh, I got another project here. It's called Yaquin, Yaquina Head Lighthouse Project. <laughs> uh, this is footage from me and Scott Wells. <clears throat> we went looking for, sorry I'm recovering from a cold. We went looking for some stuff to, for biology. And one of the places we went that day was Yaquina Head Lighthouse out of Newport, Oregon. We went down in here, the footage you're going to see of this biology, checking this stuff out. This is from months ago. I forgot I even had this footage. So, uh, <laughs> I've, I've just, but while I was looking at this right here, we didn't, I didn't go out here. Now I gotta go back. Just right here in this parking lot alone. See this, this head wall? I gotta go back just to look at this alone. I'll guarantee you there's some kick, some really good biology right in here. Just in the parking lot. So I'm gonna head back to this place here this winter and I'm gonna check out some of this stuff here on lower tides and come in through here because I'll guarantee you there's going to be some really good stuff in here but for today um, this is from like in June I think we were in here and I'll show you some stuff that's really incredible just some really good biology so this is a uh, Yaquina Head Lighthouse project and it's just only going to be one video so I'm going to get started on it and thank you for joining me okay I'm Trying to find things that I can show you and explain pretty easy without getting complicated. I Man, I see what's going on here, but this is really good stuff. The structure, the biological um, signature on everything here. And that's what I look for is a biological signature. Something that's it's, it's out of design. And it, well, it all is out of design. But uh, we're here at Yaquina Head Lighthouse on the Oregon coast. And this is, we believe, the body of the creature and it's on such a massive scale. Um, I'm going to get over here and take a look at some of this stuff. We got a, this banding, I call it, going up here. I find this stuff all over on the earth. I'm going to be doing a video on this pretty soon and show you how to find things on Google Earth with this banding. So uh, I'll be doing a video on it pretty soon. And uh, this is some really, really good stuff in here. So I'm going to look around and then uh, we'll get to talking about some of this and try to figure out what we have going on here. Um, boy, we got a lot of design. There ain't no way I can get up in there to that stuff. But Scott said, I'm here with Scott Wiles and he said he had a biologist or a geologist the other day. He was showing him some rocks. <laughs> and the geologist, he's, of course, he thinks all this is lava. This is not lava. It, you can pick up some of this rock and it is so cotton picking heavy it's like weighs a ton just a small rock it's most of it's uh, FeO2 the blood to the final stage and super heavy iron uh, but there here's that that seam that runs right up into that I'm going to try to get over to it Got some water here, we gotta cross somehow. <sighs> and this is not this is not geological uplift. There's no such thing as geological uplift. And if you're a geologist, grab you a shovel and come dig down there and show me. <laughs> I'm not trying to be mean, but prove it. Yeah. Ah, oh, this is spectacular. Wow, we're get right into the body here. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to get up in there, but I wanted to look at that up there. Come on, Elsa. Look at the structure and design of that in there. Okay. I'm going to try to get over in here and. Lots of water here. There's that lime green stuff growing that grows on the blood and these things. I'm going to try to get up in there. I'm going to turn this camera off so I don't fall down and bust the camera. Okay, we're... This is actually getting inside the body, I believe. There's just so much to look at, so much different design, structure. Hey, 
I try to get over there. The echo. Wow. Now you can see the type change. Different colors, the reds and the browns. And then you got the blacks. And then you got all this moss that's growing, feeding on the blood and stuff. The minerals coming out of it. Not sure what I but you'd I bet you'll find those maybe growth rings. Because this is all solid. It's all petrified. It's all goes back into this solid black rock here too. So I don't know. I just don't know. That's what I'm thinking. Dog over there barking. I'm trying to get up in here. Yeah, this is all different colors of reds, blacks, and then that's solid black in there. And all these colors here in the blacks. I'm a kind of in a cave here, so. All right, I'm gonna go on and find something else to look at. Yeah, I was just over in there. I'll show you some of the structure here. Design up in there. Pattern. Elsa! Elsa, come here! It goes up, jettisons out of there and turns. Anyway, there was a geologist here the other day. He was trying to tell Scott that these are lava flows clear from Idaho. That is the most retarded, the most ridiculous, stupid thing I've ever heard in my freaking life. You can pick up all these rocks along here and they're so heavy, it's not lava. It is not lava. It's biological, it uh, could be lung, it could be kidney, it could be different parts, who knows. But it's, <laughs> there's no such thing. There's no such thing as a rock. Rock do not exist body parts exist and until the world realizes that we're never going to get any further than where we are right now just button heads everybody arguing ah oh, this is so cool okay we're gonna tides coming in we're gonna get out of here and there's an old man walking on the beach with his cane Huh. That's where we'll all be eventually. Okay, I'm trying to get some more here. We got so much water running. Tide's coming in. I gotta back up here a little bit. Anyway, I want to get some pictures up there of that. It's really cool how it jettisons out of there. This is all different types of structure. Yeah. I'm gonna get swamped here in a minute. I want to try to get up there. I think the tide's coming in, though. I got to get back up here. Okay, I got to hurry in between the water here. I want you to see that right up there. I mean, you got that different type of material. You got this different type of material. You got different type of material up there. You got different type of material over there. It's biological. That's what I try to get you to see in my videos. I try to get you to look at things biologically. Okay, I gotta get out of here. I'm gone. I gotta run. <laughs> All right. We're gonna wrap it up here. Bye-bye now. Okay, I just, I realized something while I've been standing here looking, sir, trying to look at this thing. And right up in there is an abrupt transition. See all this big solid rock? And see how it starts getting smaller and smaller and smaller? Until it gets right up on the top and it's just real small round. So that in there is an abrupt transition. Right up on top of this thing. Going from that into the abrupt transition. 
and there's part of it right in there how it lays sideways it lays horizontal like that stuff I did at Seal Rock on the abrupt transition wrinkle zone that's the exact same material right in there that's why I know it's an abrupt transition and it gets smaller there and then the muscle would have been on top and it's gone now so that's what that is and I'm not sure about the rest of it here as far as being the main body um, lots to see lots to look at look at that piece right there it's different okay now I think I'm gonna wrap it up go look at something else all right